Hello everybody, this is Jeff at eTrailer.com. Today we're going to take a look at this ARC Extreme Off-Road Sidewind Swing-Up Trailer Jack with the dual wheels. It has 1,100 pounds static load capacity. Now this is a nice sturdy off-road jack, supports lifts and even lowers your boat or recreational trailer. It has the nice dual wheels on this, which will allow you to run through mud or over gravel and sharp rocks without getting stuck or damaged. The dual steel wheels use off-road rubber tires on them to provide increased traction and maneuverability. The individual wheel dimension itself, the diameter is 8 inches and 2 inches wide on each wheel. Now also what's nice is right above the tires right here you can see it uses a, lo a yoke latch at the bottom here. This offers five different positions to hold these dual wheels in place and this will allow you to tailor the configuration of your stow jack to suit your needs. So basically if you have anything mounted on your trailer tongue that the wheels might hit if they're positioned upright, you can lock them in place facing down instead. Or if you're off-roading and traveling through rough terrain where you might have issues with ground clearance, you can lock the dual wheels upright. The locking feature also keeps the wheels from swinging around while you're driving, which helps to ensure that the bearings in there don't wear out prematurely. And just to show you what we're talking about, what you'll have to do is there's five different holes and then there's a pin that goes in the holes to hold it in that position. So to release it, we'll just re or extend the jack and when you get it far enough, you can see the pin comes out of the hole and that'll allow you to, let me just tilt it back here, and you'll be able to see that you can swing this into whatever position you need. Again, there's five different positions. And once you get it to where you need it, then you just crank your jack back down, retract it, and when that pin goes into that hole and you retract it all the way, it locks it in that position. So it's a nice feature to lock those wheels in. Now this does use a thick-walled square tubing. It's precision machine to limit the play between both the inner and outer tubes. It does have this spring-loaded pin right over here with the nice easy grip handle. This will let you easily swing the jack into place. Basically, if you just pull this pin, it's spring-loaded. You pull the pin and then pivot the, stow, the jack up to stow parallel to the trailer tongue for travel. And then when you get to where you need be and you want to lower it down to put it in the upright position, again, just pull that, the pin releases it, and it'll swing down and then lock it into position with the pin. Now it does offer four different height positions and that's on the other side so I'm going to try to turn this around just so we can see that. So you'll see this right over here. This pull easy to grip handle on this side will give you four different height settings. You can see here's two pins so one, two, three, four and those four height settings will get you about seven and five eighths inches range. This allows for nice, fast, easy positioning. You don't have to worry about any blocks or drop legs needed to drop it down or gain that extra height. The handle here, again, spring-loaded, you just pull it completely out, and then you just slide it up or down whatever height you need, so it'll reduce the cranking time and the effort that's needed. Now, the crank is a nice sidewind hand crank. It'll easily remove for storage. It's basically just attached with a nice, sturdy internal magnet. So you just pull on it, and it comes right off and put it back on, you line it up, and it snaps in, it's magnetized so it stays in place there. Now this is a bolt-on installation. All the hardware brackets and hardware is included to install this. It's a sturdy steel construction, it's very durable, it's built to last, and it is corrosion and rust resistant zinc finish on it, gives it, gives it a 600 hour salt spray rating. And this jack is designed in Australia so it does stand up to the rigors of the Outback. A few specs on this again, the application is for trailer tongues from 2 inches up to 6 inches tall. Now the usable lift, in other words the amount of screw travel is 10 and 3 quarter inches. The total travel, when we add the adjustment height, the four, height, the four different height adjustments here, so if you, the whole uh, usable lift is 10 and 3 quarter inches, the total if we add that 7 and 5 eighths will give us a total travel of 18 and 3 eighths inches. And the bracket height the bracket height is always measured from the center of the bracket down to the ground to where the tires are. So with it retracted, like in this position, if we measured from the ground up to the center here, is going to be 11 and a half inches. If we fully ex raise this up to the highest position and then extended it all the way out, your total extended height, bracket height, would be 29 and 7 eighths inches. And the static load capacity on this is 1,100 pounds. 
But that should do it for the review on this ARC Extreme Off-Road Sidewind Swing-Up Trailer Jack with the dual wheels and 1,100 pounds static load capacity.